Hi, Gemini, and welcome back to my channel. Whether you are Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or however Gemini may show up on your astrological birth chart, then these messages are for you. And today I'm going to be channeling messages focusing on what's going on right now at this moment in time in February, what's to come in these last two weeks. And some of you may be entering this energy. Some of you may be exiting this energy. Some of you may be present in this energy right about now. But before I begin, those of you who are new to my channel, welcome. My name is Alexa Tarot, and I am a second degree Reiki practitioner, as well as an intuitive tarot and oracle reader. I want to start off by saying thank you to you, my subscribers, my new viewers, and visitors alike for your love, your support, and your loyalty to our channel. I greatly appreciate it. As you know, these are all free channeled messages and the only thing i ask in return is if you could please give me a thumbs up like share or subscribe so that i know that you are enjoying these free channeled messages and don't forget turn on your notification bell so you don't miss out on new content upload or whenever i go live on my live stream all right gemini let's take a look here at what may be going on right now at this moment in time and what is to come here potentially in regards to what blessings you're attracting here in the month of February, okay? So let's take a look here at what's coming through for you, Gemini. What's coming through for you, Gemini? Let's see. Actually, let me move these forward a little bit. There we go. And let's see what's coming through for you. You have here medicine person, okay? So this is talking about uh, you are a channel for divine healing uh, divine healing power. Okay. So here, Gemini, this is coming through as you being either one or two things. You may be in the process of healing at this moment in time, whether that is mentally, spiritually, energetically, physically on the men's, but there's a sense here of this healing power. Okay. Now, for others of you here, I feel that you are the person that's either being called to uh, heal others or support others in some way, shape, or form here in the month of uh, February. Okay, you are a channel. It's like your frequency is aligned to accepting or downloading here messages. Okay, so some of you may be uh, may have may notice here that in the month of February you're either um, you know having very vivid dreams. Okay, um, able to meditate and kind of like journey, see things through your meditation, feel things, your intuition may be on the rise here. But I'm getting there's this sense of uh, alignment here. Now, again, this could be for yourself, right? In a specific area of your life, that being love, career, or in another area, or you being able to help and guide others, okay? By, uh, by you know, being that support unit for someone else, okay? Okay, when that happens, this just means that my guides, my team wants me to shuffle a little bit more. Let's take a look here at what else is coming through for you. You have exchanging gifts. Yeah, pretty much. Um, Wait, hold on. Pretty much the energy I was feeling here a little while ago. Okay, there's this sense of give and take. Now, for some of you, that sense of give and take, look at that, and poise, feeling very empowered and confident. And, you know, I'm going to bring this out here just to give you a, a glimpse here. You have two cards that even though they are from different decks, they're doing the same thing in regards to their gesture, okay? So there's this sense of being open, open, surrendering, and receiving here from the universe. Now, exchanging gift here is coming across energetically as you being willing to. Okay, allowing yourself to surrender to the process, um, kind of like allowing yourself to accept. So some of you are accepting support and help from others, acceptance of love, acceptance, you know, in that kind of like allowing flow. Others of you here, it's coming across as what you've been putting into something will be coming back uh, as a reciprocal energy, okay, kind of give and take that six of pentel, pentacles energy in tarot. Now, granted, this isn't a tarot deck, this is an oracle deck, but it's definitely coming, um, coming across there as a very kind of six of pentacles type of energy, that reciprocal 
type of give and take, okay? What you're putting into something, maybe what you are um, getting in return. For others of you, I'm getting here to be very vigilant here, to just have this message in the back of your mind that if you are giving too much to something and you feel that you're not getting the same in return, not, it doesn't have to be the same, but it's, it's like you're over pouring into something or someone and you don't feel that energetic mutual reciprocity give uh, yourself a moment to uh kind of meditate and see is this you know is this a situation circumstance or event that i should continue to pour in the manner that i am pouring into it right all right let's take a look at what else is coming through here for the month of february the last two weeks or maybe what's been going on here for you hand to fate look at that now this says forces beyond your control intervene all right and for some of you it may be as i said at the top of the reading that you may be either in this healing um type of energy you're allowing yourself to heal yourself either mentally physically energetically or spiritually there's a sense of you in this kind of like stance of allowance a stance of acceptance okay and through that um action or through that surrendering there's this energy here as if you are ready, you're more confident, okay? You are more empowered, okay? To really also observe these two cards here, meditating and observing is something that you are giving or pouring your heart and soul and energy in the same that you are receiving in some way, shape, or form, okay? So, you know, it's like kind of giving yourself that, um, a moment to take a step back and really recalibrate and assess here. Am I over pouring into something? Now, here's another thing that just came through. Is something, is someone or is someone over pouring into you and you are resisting? Okay. If that's the case, this may be the reason why this was talking about here in the month of February, February, you opening up your energy and allowing the sense of surrendering so that you are in the receiving end of this beautiful abundance okay hand of faith so there could be things here out of your control that you may not know that you may not see things are falling into place for some of you other things you are able to see or are clearly seeing what is uh in need of you kind of like continue to pouring into someone or something or pulling back the energy, okay? You also have here, um, you will receive news from afar. There could be here some messages coming in. And like I said at the top of the reading, I'm getting like through meditation, through your dreams, you may be getting some downloads here in the month of February. Something that um, kind of like because you are open, there's a sense of you co-creating with the universe and being able to download or sense through gut level feeling, your intuition, your higher self sense what something is, when something is beyond your control and how you can, again, adjust if needed, okay? All right, let's take a last look here at this last deck. What else is coming through for you here? Blessing coming in. Look at that beautiful two of cups. Some of you, this is related to, uh, and look at this eight of wands. So definitely here's something coming through as message. Okay. Eight of wands here. I man, I manifest, um, multiple opportunities. Some of you may be, um, receiving some information here. It could be job related. It could be in love, but you could be receiving here a message or may have already received here a message of either love or career having to do with something that you've been waiting for. Two of cups here says I am worthy of the deepest kind of love. Exactly what I was talking about earlier at the top of this reading. There is a sense of you understanding your worth, you like really come Coming into your power, stepping into your power and realizing, am I putting in the investment and in someone who's also putting in the investment in me? Okay. Now this could be in job. This could be in love or this could be in other areas of your life. Are you over pouring for others of you? This is signifying here a stronger bond. Now that bond can be in work. Okay. So it could be networking closer uh, with your colleagues, closer with your staff. If you're supervising or managing or owner of a company, there's a sense of um, this mutual 
you know, give and take here. Okay. So this really kind of good vibe here between uh, you and either the people you work for, your people you work with, or the clientele. For others of you, this is definitely talking about love. If you are in a partnership, I do feel that there is a sense of a more of an exchange this month, passion, romance. There could be a lot of texts, being able to, uh, you know, communicate how you're feeling here. For others of you, if you're starting a friendship with this two of cups is blossoming and blooming it may be going in a direction that you may not have expected here in the month of february and there's more communication here kind of about or towards this kind of either love or friendship elevating or ascending uh, a higher level of commitment gemini i hope these messages have been insightful don't forget to give me a thumbs up like share subscribe and i'll see you soon